The future is about autonomous plants. At least that's the big dream, that all these plants are gonna run autonomously, they're gonna run safely, they're gonna run super efficiently. And it's a big dream, and I think we could just take steps along the way. And um, you know, certainly artificial intelligence and all of this IoT data is gonna be a big component in really this plant aut automation process. Now, what does it mean for the Maximo community? These are reliability engineers, absolutely critical and more critical as we go forward. You know, data is exploding. There's, in the next three years, there'll be 21 billion sensors powering the world with huge amounts of data. And what to do with that data? You can use AI and artificial intelligence and ML to really make some sense out of data for prediction and prescription. Basically predicting what's gonna happen to your asset or your process, and today, what should I do about that today? Now, now it comes down to people, right? This is the world of multivariate analysis. All of this artificial intelligence stuff is really interesting, but without the reliability engineers know-how and domain expertise putting that into the system, nothing happens. So it becomes even more important. So typically reliability has been in what I call swim lanes, right? Vibration, infrared, oil analysis. But the future is about multivariate analysis to put all of this information together, including the operating conditions, the thermodynamic conditions, the temperature, pressure, all of this, uh, even the material properties of, you know, kind of what you're working on type of thing. And who can put this together is the reliability engineer, the Maximo user, because they have it. You know, artificial intelligence uses this network of so-called neural nets, and really the neural net of knowledge is in the brains of the Maximo community, and they have to be putting this in. The data sciences, they'll learn. You know, there's great tools coming on the market today for so-called citizen data scientists, and it's not a typical citizen, it's an engineer with know-how, but putting this knowledge in will make this prediction and prescription for running much more autonomously happen.